How to Prevent and Treat Skin Problems in Dogs Due to Chemical Irritants 100 Words Dogs, like humans, can experience various skin problems caused by exposure to chemical irritants. These irritants can range from household cleaners and pesticides to certain grooming products. It is essential for dog owners to be aware of these potential hazards and take preventative measures to protect their furry companions. Additionally, understanding the appropriate treatment methods for skin issues caused by chemical irritants is crucial to ensure the well-being and comfort of our four-legged friends. 1. Identifying Chemical Irritants 200 Words The first step in preventing and treating skin problems in dogs due to chemical irritants is to identify the potential culprits. Numerous household products, such as cleaning agents, laundry detergents, and air fresheners, contain chemicals that can trigger skin reactions in dogs. Similarly, pesticides, fertilizers, and certain plants can also cause skin irritation. Additionally, some grooming products, including shampoos and conditioners, may contain ingredients that are harsh on a dog's skin. Two prevention measures, 300 words. Preventing skin problems in dogs due to chemical irritants involves taking several proactive measures. Firstly, dog owners should be mindful of the products they use around their pets. Opting for natural, non-toxic alternatives and avoiding products with harsh chemicals can significantly reduce the risk of skin irritation. When using cleaning or grooming products around dogs, it is advisable to thoroughly rinse the treated areas to ensure complete removal of any residue. Regularly inspecting a dog's living environment is also crucial. Ensure that toxic plants are out of reach and that no exposed wires or cords are available for chewing. When using pesticides or fertilizers in the garden, keep dogs away from treated areas until it is safe for them to roam freely. Additionally, providing a properly balanced diet and using high-quality dog grooming products can contribute to healthier skin, minimizing the likelihood of chemical irritant-related skin issues. 3. Recognizing Symptoms 300 Words Dog owners must be diligent in recognizing the signs of skin problems caused by chemical irritants. Common symptoms include redness, swelling, itchiness, rashes, hair loss, and dry or flaky skin. Excessive scratching, biting, or licking of certain areas may also indicate irritation. If these symptoms persist or worsen, it is essential to consult a veterinarian for an accurate diagnosis and appropriate treatment plan. For treatment options, 400 words. When it comes to treating skin problems in dogs caused by chemical irritants, timely and appropriate actions are vital. Depending on the severity of the condition, treatment options may vary. Mild cases of irritation can often be alleviated through regular bathing with hypoallergenic, fragrance-free dog shampoo. It is essential to choose products specifically formulated for dogs with sensitive skin. When selecting grooming products, carefully read the ingredient labels to ensure they do not contain any known irritants. In case of more severe skin issues, a veterinarian may prescribe medicated shampoos, creams, or ointments to suit the affected areas. These medications are designed to alleviate inflammation, reduce itching, and promote healing. Additionally, oral medications, such as antihistamines or steroids, may be prescribed to manage severe allergic reactions or persistent skin problems caused by chemical irritants. Conclusion 100 Words Protecting our furry companions from skin problems resulting from chemical irritants requires awareness, preventive measures, and prompt treatment. By identifying potential irritants, implementing preventive measures, promptly recognizing symptoms, and seeking appropriate treatment options, dog owners can ensure their pets enjoy healthy skin, free from the discomfort of chemical irritant-related issues. Remember, our dogs rely on us to keep them safe, so let's make sure their skin stays healthy and happy.